Hi, it's Tristan here again, and today I am joined by another highly venomous snake. This is the Eastern Vine Snake, Thelotornis mozambicensis. Now, in Zimbabwe, we get two vine snakes. One of them is a subspecies uh, of the southern vine snake called Thelotornis capensis oatesii, oatesii, sorry and we get this one, the eastern vine snake. Now, it is quite hard to tell between the two. However, the eastern vine snake is only found here in the Hondi Valley, in this highland uh, rainforest, and also on the head there. So all vine snakes, you get uh, the subspecies of the capensis, and you get the capensis, and you get the mozambic mozambicansis. And all of those three have got that green top to the head and they have this sort of line of brown or orange that goes through the eye from the nose below the green top. Now, in the Capensis and the Otesii, that uh, green line, every scale that crosses it is flecked with black. So you can, you can tell the difference between them and also it's got the otesii has either a y or a t a black y or a, or a or a t on top of the head in that green bit however the eastern vine snake in that orange or brown band has got black dots the scales aren't black flecked on the edges it's just got black dots which you can see here so what, I'm, what I've got here is quite a special little snake. And I mean, look at the snake. No wonder people don't see many of them. I mean, that body is the perfect color to be a stick. It's even got like moss imprints. I mean, it is perfectly camouflaged. And they, when, when they're in the trees, they sway with the tree as if they're a branch in the wind. They are very clever. And these snakes probably have the best eyesight out of any snake in Africa. They have binocular vision and their pupils are different to any other snake you'll find in Africa. They've got a keyhole shape. They're designed to spot prey. Their favorite food is chameleons. They love chasing down chameleons and of course chameleons are masters of camouflage and so are they. So they need to have immaculate vision to spot them and great camouflage. Now these snakes, these vine snakes, have got a hemotoxic venom. Now there are only two snakes uh, in Zimbabwe, two types of snakes uh, with hemotoxic venom and that's the boomslang and the vine snake. And hemotoxic venom is a really nasty venom. That venom stops the coagulation of blood and so basically you bleed your blood vessels rupture and you start bleeding from all your old cuts uh, you start bleeding from your nose, your eyes, your ears everywhere, it's a really horrible poison it's quite fast acting, it's faster than cytotoxic venoms but it's not as fast as neurotoxic ones but it is by far a horrible, horrible venom and there you can see that bright bright orange tongue with that black tip now that is part of a warning because that orange and black, characteristic in the animal kingdom, to be a warning mechanism. So he's saying, watch out, I am a deadly thing, and do not mess with me. The other thing he'll do, he's quite relaxed now, he's also cold, it's a very cold day today. But another thing they'll do, same with the boomslang, is they puff up their throat. And it, big enough to fit a golf ball in it, it's quite an amazing sort of defensive posturing. Right now he's staying still, he's relying on his camouflage here. And he blends quite well. So they've got a, they've got a very good defensive posturing, which helps uh, ward away humans and other predators. Another interesting thing about these snakes is they're back fanged, and that means that their fangs most you've got most snakes have got fangs on the front of the mouth, uh, right below the nose. That's your adders, all your adders like your puff adders, your gaboon adders. They've all got fangs at the front of the mouth. Uh, and then, and also your mumbers as well, they've also got fangs at the front of their mouths and cobras. But your boomslangs and your vine snakes, as well as a few other snakes, have got their fangs
behind the eye. And they're really small, more small fangs right behind the eye. And that is because of because of their prey items like chameleons and birds. They often prey on birds. Another name for the snake is the bird snake. However, birds aren't their main main uh, food source because they're quite hard to capture. But though that fang structure is designed so that they can bite on and they hold on, injecting large quantities of venom. Uh, and they hold on to their prey because they can't let it go because if they were bite if they were to bite and hold and let go of a bird the bird would fly away and they would lose the scent trail unlike an adder which bites on and lets go immediately and then follows up the scent trail of a dead rat or mouse so their fang structure is really ingenious and most people you've you've probably if you know a bit about snakes you've probably heard most people saying uh oh, back fang snakes you struggle to get bitten by them that's actually not really true Boomslungs and vine snakes can open up their jaws an enormous amount and they can easily strike and inject venom without having to chew on. However, they are tree dwelling snakes and they do not come onto the ground as often and this camouflage, you very rarely see them. And so, they don't actually cause, I don't think there's been a, there hasn't been a single recorded death from a vine snake in southern Africa because they just don't come in contact with people at all but oh he's a beautiful snake this check you can see his throat's puffing up a bit revealing that blue skin in between the scales every time I put him down he feels safer on the tongs because it feels like a branch but when he's on the ground you see oh look at that puffing up the throat big there you can see the blue blue skin in between the scales and that black spot oh look at that that's a proper puff up there he doesn't like being on the ground. Second he goes up into the tongs, very relaxed because he feels it's like a stick. But on the ground, he's not happy. Not a happy snake. I hope you enjoyed that close encounter with an eastern vine snake. See you soon.